Now, in this last autumn series of Top Gear, we ran a Lombard RAC rally competition with the first prize being three days all expenses paid at the control centre in Nottingham, plus a charge around a real rally stage with a world-class rally driver. The second prize, they say, was two charges round a real uh, rally stage with a world-class rally driver. The winner is a young lady from Bath called Trish Tenno. She's with me now. Trish, are you a dyed-in-the-wool uh, rally fan? Yes, I am. Yes. Do you actually come out at night in the, in the damp and the cold and stand beside these tracks? Yes, I so. Have yes. you ever driven in a rally car? No, never. You no, haven't? No. Are you regretting at all you won this competition? <laughs> <I could not> <laughs> Do you know who yeah. your driver is? Yes, because he is yeah. he is acknowledged as being you know one of the quickest guys over the gravel there is. Yes, marvellous. <laughs> so let's get you in the car before you change your mind, Trish, shall we? Thank you. <laughs> Stig Blomkis was last year's world champion and is very brisk indeed. And so too is the car. It's Ford's multi-million pound re-entry into the world of top-class rallying, the RS200. Sadly, not in this year's event, but what a prospect for next. How do you feel about it? Fantastic. Really? Yes, absolutely. What about the noise inside there? Is it really giving it the gun? It's not too bad at all, no? really. And no. the violence as he's going around those yes, red vents? Yes, it's the G-force that got me. Really? Yes. We heard the tremendous roar though as he kicked it off at the start yes, over there. Yes, I felt it. Yeah? You can get bitten, you know. <laughs> yes, I know. Who wants a co-driver? <laughs> How would you feel doing this for, say, 600 miles day in, day out, five days? It must be very tiring. I don't know how they do it. Really? Fantastic. While you're recovering, yes. we're not going to go back to uh, Rally Control Headquarters at Nottingham where Sue Baker is waiting for us.